Hey guys, Mechanic CG here, and welcome back to another episode of Test Drive Unlimited PlayStation 2 Edition. Today is episode number 26. If you guys do want to keep up to date with the TDU PS2 series, make sure to hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell. And also, don't forget to check the description for our social links. We have Twitter, Discord, and Instagram. But hopefully you guys do enjoy today's video. Right, so I've had a look uh, and counted how many clubs I have unlocked so far on the map. And we have 32 clubs unlocked. And from the forums that I've read, there are 34 clubs in this game. Which means there are two more locked. I had a look. And by the looks of it, we need to have the all-wheel drive club unlocked. Which I haven't seen us unlock that yet. And the convertible... Uh, Honolulu executives unlocked as well, which needs roadster cars. Now, this Lamborghini Gallardo, yes, we already have the Gallardo Coupe, but that's the wrong way. This Gallardo Roadster, the thing is, to unlock the all wheel drive and the exec, you need three cars. So you need three four wheel drive cars and three cars that are convertible. Now, this is convertible, so that will add one to the convertible list, but it will also add one to the four-wheel drive list. So, we're killing two birds with one stone here in one car. Now, it's expensive, I know, but we don't really have a choice. Um, and also, it gives us a chance to drive it as well, because I think for the execs one, this would be very good to drive. Um, obviously, we have a red Lambo, so we'll go for... I don't want to go black, but I don't want to go blue. I don't want to go orange either. Maybe that, because that's quite a nice silver color. So we'll go for that one. Uh, interior wise, I think you need to go for this. If you're executive and posh. Uh, not enough garage space, of course. Okay. Uh, we need to find one that's not convertible and not four wheel drive. Which one do we know is not four-wheel drive? Um, I feel like the AC, but I want to keep the AC for now. We'll get rid of the GT500, because that's definitely not convertible and definitely not four-wheel drive. Let's buy it. Please tell me I've unlocked the clubs. All-wheel drive club unlocked. Tell me we get the convertible as well. Not quite the convertible club, but we have unlocked the all-wheel drive club, which is awesome. We're going to have to get ourselves an, one more convertible car somehow. And I don't even know where from. So, uh, let's work it out. Right, so based on the fact we need ourselves one more convertible car, uh, the cheapest car that I've managed to find is actually the Saturn Sky Roadster. <laughs> it's the only Saturn in this game. Um, I feel like we should just buy it in yellow. Why not? Buy this vehicle. Not enough garage space. Yes, we know. Uh, we're going to sell the AC because we never really drive that much. We're gonna confirm that, and hopefully, your itinerary is being recalculated. No. Have we already unlocked the execs then? Ah, oh, if I have a look and I've already unlocked it, I'll be sad, because I just sold my AC for that. Ah, uh, to be fair, I wouldn't have driven it anyways. But like, hang on, clubs. How many have we got here? Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three. Still counted thirty-three. So we are missing one club. Which one is it then? There's the Honolulu execs. So we have already unlocked it. Oh shit. I've got the wrong one. Bugger. Right, so this is, if I'm right, I think that I saw one called Ka Kahulu Club. And the only cars eligible were Nobles, I think. Or the ones that were listed. Bearing in mind we don't own a Noble. Maybe if we buy one of these, we might have a chance of actually finding this club. Uh, so we're going to buy a Noble. Oh, that's quite nice in red, actually. Let's go like that. Um... Oh, I do like that. Wow. Okay. Impressive. Okay, so we've got no garage space. Now, we're definitely not going to drive the Saturn. So, uh, we have wasted a little bit of money. But hopefully, this unlocks the final club. 
Please. Yes! Kappa Hulu Club. That's the final club that we need to worry about. And we have unlocked every single club. So we now know exactly how many clubs there are. And we don't have to worry about that anymore. Awesome. Right, so first of all, we are actually going to take the Noble. And we are going to put on the maximum performance pack. Uh, we'll get ourselves 510 brake horsepower. Confirm upgrade. Yes, please. Very nice. So we are going to be doing this one. Um, and we are going to do the club that we just unlocked. So uh, we're going to find the location, see where it is. Uh, it's somewhere towards the uh, south center, I know. So let's have a look. Honolulu execs. Where is it? Somewhere here. There you are. Filter. So uh, let's make our way to the club then. Right, so here we go. We are in the Noble M400. We're going to be doing the club exclusive for Nobles. And uh, this car, although sixth gear is very slow, has a lot of acceleration through first and second. Um, so this is going to be a fun car to drive. Uh, we got ourselves another dealership unlocked, I think. Very nice. Oh, the slides. Here we go. The club is just here. Around this corner. Where is the corner? Here it is. Let's go into the club. Auto Club Hawaii. I also found out only six of the clubs actually reward cars as well. Uh, which is interesting. Right. So the top car is a Noble M400. So we are safe there. Let's start. This is going to be as close as it's going to get, though, in terms of uh, competition. Because uh, all of the nobles were pretty much a level playing field. But luckily, didn't cost us anything to upgrade this car. And off we go. Look at that acceleration. Straight off the line. Gone. Car equals no more. Very nice. It's going really well so far. Awesome. Again, having like 34 clubs to actually complete is pretty impressive. 34 times 6. Uh, if I do quick maths... Well, that's 180 races. Oh, crap. We've gone off. We've gone off. No. Quick maths doesn't win the race. Right, here we go. Do not crash off this corner. Perfect. So, yeah, there are uh, 204 head-to-head -head races. Six per club. 34 clubs. Times them together. 204. That's 204 head-to-head -head events. They can take anywhere between a minute. Oh, not ideal. Why are you stuck? You're joking. What the hell? All right. Third time's a charm. Yes, apparently it is. Hopefully. Do not crash again. Please, I beg. There we go. Under the underpass here. This has given me a headache recording... Uh, not recording, editing tonight now. That's going to give me a massive headache <laughs> trying to sort that out. Ah! Uh, this car hates me. Absolutely hates me. But there we go. 1 minute 29.044. That's a very good time there. Awesome. This is sixth club recording today. Loads of clubs. Right, next up is the Noble M14. Let's go. Go and beat that car. We've done so many club events today. I feel like after this club, we're going to have to do some races so I don't go crazy. We've done loads of head-to-heads. But here we go. Second event. 
Let's do this. Off we go. One point five miles, that's it. Okay. Interesting. Wow. Unbelievable. How are we going to catch up with that now? The AI car crashing in a car into us. We're going to use the AI car to get around that corner then. The AI car crashed and the car, traffic car, ended up going into our own car. Wow. Unbelievable. That is just not fair. Right, we've got a tight corner coming up. Hopefully the AI car can stay behind us. We've gone off road, but we've saved it. And we're across the line in first place. Awesome. And there we go. 3,250 credits. Next up is going to be a Noble M400. Going to be the same car as us. All right, here we go. Same make, same model, head-to-head -head next. We're going to do this. And the fact that the uh, Noble is a very nice car. I've always wanted to drive one in this game. Um, since we started this playthrough. But I uh, never got around to getting one. And there was sort of no point after we completed B-Class. Or, well, we haven't completed it. So we could get even another chance to do a proper race in this. But uh, since we've done that, there sort of wasn't... Oh, that's not great. There uh, sort of wasn't a point to go through and try and get another one. But, uh, well, to do this club, we have to have a Noble. So there's your excuse for getting one. Ah, no. Come on. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Stop moving forwards. Oh, my days. Stupid lorries. Ah. This club has been a nightmare so far. It's been one of the most stressful ones. Let's put it that way. Ah. Squeezing through the traffic. No, don't hit anything. Ah, uh, we've got off road. <laughs> My heart is racing right now trying to get through this. Once we've done this club, I'm retiring. <laughs> I'm a hand the pres. Actually, no, I deserve the presidency if I win this. Also, come on very good drift there. What's the interior like for this car? Ooh, fancy. Not fancy enough though for me to stay in it. And there we go. Across the finish line. 134.143. Okay. <sighs> that was crazy. Crazy. Right, so next up is a Noble M12 GTO 3R. Same car as the first vehicle we drove against in this uh, championship. Let's have a look and see whether we can destroy this car. And win against it. The M12 is a little bit sort of like a lookalike of the uh, M400. I think I prefer the look of the M400 though. It's a little bit nicer looking. This is very good. I'm liking this. Oh, we got massive airtime through there. 357 points, 8 points, 175 points. It's crazy. Oh, no. Okay, reverse. Accelerate. And the speedo has speeded past us. Hopefully we can regain that. Shouldn't be too difficult, hopefully. Oh, no, he's crashed. That's given us a chance to go meow. 
That was lucky. We would be very close to him right now, but we are ahead of him big time because of that crash. Right, and remember left-hand road. That stop sign saving us from booking a table for two with a wall. Let's go cut across here. There we go, nice. We got the win. Speedo speeding past us, but we speedoed past him. Awesome. 7,500 credits for that race. It was very good. Right, next up is Ballers. Jose, Jose Ballers Garcia. And he is in a Noble M14. Let's go. We got to beat this car somehow. Big time. But once we've done this club, I think we'll do a couple of normal races. And just get back into the swing of uh, driving cars normally. Racing properly. Here we go. Nice. And across the line. Ta-da. Oh, wait. No, that's the start. Oh, shit. <laughs> I wish it was the finish line, though. I think I'm done for clubs today. Six of them. And not good, not good. Ball is getting slowed down by the traffic cars, though. I have just remembered, though, how short this race is. So uh, trying to get past him is top priority right now. No! Ah, GG's to him, though. Taking advantage of that opportunity. Let's, uh... Go and restart straight away. See if we can do this without crashing big time. Come on. The only reason I'm not uh, cutting that bit out is because uh, that was a very short race. And I feel like we need to do it again. Extend the videos out. And he's crashed straight away. So we're going to take advantage of that big time now. Here we go. Come on. Squeeze in through. Nice. Going to enjoy seeing how much percentage we've actually finished now with these uh, races. Because we was on 44% at the start of the uh, session. So hopefully we can be a lot more at the end of the session as well. But there we go. Cross the finish line. Nice. Perfect. That is very good. We got one more race left to go. And that is going to be against a Noble M400, just like us. For the presidency against Callum Reeves. Let's go. We're not going to let them get away with this win. We're going to win ourselves. And here we go. There's that lighthouse again. And off we go. And an instant crash from the Noble. Bad luck is all I'm going to say. Getting ourselves over 600 points through those first two jumps. Traffic cars coming from the side. But not quite driving into our path just yet. Very nice. Come on. Ah, slow down, slow down. We are flying today. But uh, we don't want to crash. Nice, nice, nice. We're going the wrong way down the road right now. Awesome. Oh, we got a hairpin corner. Crap. You are driving in the wrong direction. Please quick, 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 quick. Get it back. Woo! Congratulations, your next vehicle upgrade is free. Ta-da! That was decent.
And just under six seconds ahead as well. That was a very good race today. Only 90,000 points in this entire episode. That is crazy. Right, so we are on our way to the first race of today's recording session. And probably, well, the only few races I'm going to do today. Um, so, obviously, we've done six clubs today. So, we're going to do some races. Just mix it up a bit. Um, but we are doing the Supercar Series. Now, the reason for this is because the reward car is the overpowered Chrysler. Um, so, yeah, I have been looking at the forums. I can remember this being... We actually checked up on it before as well. Um, but, yeah, the way you get the overpowered Chrysler and the really fast car, actually, really fast, um, is by completing the Supercar Series. And that is a five lap, uh, five race series. Again, check this up as well to decide whether I wanted to do it today or not. And these races aren't super long either, so it's not going to be too stressful. So this will be a good way to finish off this recording session. I ain't going around there. I'm going straight on. Ah, oh, it's going to make me jump. Fine. Here we go. So here is the start of the series. Uh, this is one way you get fast travel to the next event, I think. So a uh, supercars one. Let's do this. Uh, so what restriction is it? It is an A-class vehicle restriction, which is good. Because that means we can drive the Pagani Zonda again. We'll give this a go. Uh, it's expert level as well, so it's not super difficult. Uh, 2.5 miles, 5 laps. Let's go. I definitely am looking forward to getting this Chrysler, though. But here we go. Time for the Zonda to have a go. And get a win. Oh, apparently not. So we've got six Zondas here. I do like uh, driving the Zondas because they are pretty nice cars. I do like... Oh, come on. Stop it. <laughs> Managed to nicely recover there. Oh, the AI cars really do not like that corner. Wow. All of them stuck. Unbelievable. That is four cars stuck there. Only one car managing to make it through slightly unscathed. It's very good, though. Obviously, 2.5 mile race per lap. Um, but it is going to be five laps. Oh, very nice. So hopefully we don't mess up that hairpin corner like the AI cars did. That was a little bit embarrassing for them. Good. Awesome. Nice. Look at that corner. That was good. Are the AI cars going to mess up? Uh, so far, one didn't. By the looks of it, the rest of them are probably going to make it too. Awesome. This car is firmly planted to the ground right now. Taking out the stop signs there. Can't tell me to stop. Haha. -ha. It's still really warm. Hopefully tomorrow it's a little bit cooler. Because I've had to stop a couple of times. Um, because it's gotten a bit too hot. Um, so we're going to do this these five races that's going to be me done for today then after that because uh i don't want to die preferably oh and we spun out unbelievable okay get back on track i'm really excited to get this chrysler Oh, 
awesome. The fly just uh, managed to headbutt my window. Can you hear it in my ear? It's annoying. Go away. Okay, very nice. So after three laps, we've done about three minutes and 20 seconds. So we should finish this race by about, what, 5.30? As long as we do some very good runs for the rest of this race. At the next intersection, turn right. Oh, spun out. Not great. Nice recovery, though. The amount of races, though, is still pretty crazy. Like, it took me less time to finish Need for Speed Heat than it's taken me to do this. That is crazy when you think of it that way. Like, Need for Speed Heat. How many episodes did I do? I did less than 20. Because I remember making 20 thumbnails for before uh, I started the series. And never using them all and being like, well, that was a disappointment. This is where we're going to start getting loads of master points today, though. And credits. Hopefully, as well, the uh, Chrysler has a upgrade package. Uh, it would be really cool to see that going at, like, 5,000 miles an hour. That is obvious sarcasm. Nice. And onto the brakes. Hard. Perfect. Nice. And here comes the finish line. Just under that uh, 5 minute 30 that I predicted halfway through. Decent. And we got 51,000 credits for that. Let's go straight to the next event. Race number two of five. Here we go. So this is 5.6 miles per lap. And three laps in total. So this is going to be a little bit longer than the other races. Uh, probably going to take about six to seven minutes. But let's do it. Here we go, very nice. Starting on the overpass this time. I think I'm actually going to enjoy this race. Because uh, these ones on the motorways can be pretty fun. Sonders are off to a great start there. Ah, we're off to a rubbish start. Right at the back in last place now. If we can rely on some slipstream here. We've got loads of airtime as well going over those bumps. Um, but by the looks of it, this is just like a highway race. Going one way down the highway and then another way. We're going to rely on this. Oh, Jesus. Holy Jeebus. Okay, uh, we're dropping down here. Making our way back around. Making our way downtown. Nice. So I'm guessing for this part of the section, we're going to go down uh, the more sort of city roads where there are corners, more corners, and me make our way back to the highway area. a very good lap actually quite fun uh, we're being forced the wrong way down the road but there are no traffic cars so not a problem there going the wrong way Here we 
go, slow down, perfect. Well, the Zunder's done a great job there. Nice. We're on the other side of the road now. I don't know if this is where we're supposed to be. Yeah, definitely not where we're supposed to be. Because uh, you can see there are barriers there now. <laughs> Awesome. Back onto the highway. Let's go. Let's get on. And go speeding down here. This is where we're going to get our airtime again. Should get quite a lot of points for uh, the little jumps. 191. 199. Nothing. Gutted. We get anything here? 146. Anything here? 16. Wow. And we missed it. Oh dear. Loads of points through there though. At least a thousand points just from airtime. At least. It's really nice. I do quite like this track. It's a very fun track to drive down. Lots of opportunities for drifting, jumping, and skills to pay the bills. Perfect. Right, back onto the wrong side of the road again. More airtime. Oh no! Unbelievable! That was crazy. The airtime we got from that crash. We're still miles ahead of the other cars. I don't actually see them. Uh, we are so far ahead. I feel like I should actually turn up my difficulty a bit. Like, genuinely, this is easy now. But I don't want to turn it up and then lose big time. Because I know you have to complete all of these races and win. I don't know. We are quite far ahead though. I can't believe the AI cars could be that much better. There might be. You never know. Right, time for the jumps again. Loads more points there. Jeez. 220. All right, taking it around here. I love the map. I love this map. It's amazing. I really want, like, I don't know where it is, but there is definitely a race going down those motorways where all those roads are. There is definitely a race in this game. I just need to work out where it is, what it's called. Or even where, the, where on earth we are right now. Obviously, this is the uh, second... Oh, no. Second supercar race. So we can use that as a reference. But I need to find that race. I cannot remember where it is. With this map being so large, though, there is so much races. So many races. Like... Gran Turismo cannot keep up with how many different races they have. I mean, Gran Turismo 4 is a huge game. So, I'm looking forward to playing that. But, like, this is really fun. 
Uh, okay. Weaving in between those there. Going off the road there as well. Not ideal. And there we go. Across the line. Seven minutes that time. Seven minutes, seven seconds, point one. All right. 68,000 credits. Let's go straight to the next event. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe. If you want to help support the channel, make sure to hit that join button or click on the merch link in the description. It would mean the world to me. And also, don't forget to check in the description for our other social links. We've got Twitter, Instagram, and Discord. So make sure to follow us over on there. But thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.